So, I'm filming a sit down video right now. Let me just get in. There we go. Get in camera. Um, something. Actually, hold up one second. I need. I need something real fast. Better. Something was brought to my attention today that I wouldn't want to get off my chest a little bit here. It was on Facebook. A, a group called Bad Wrestlers Exposed. And the first thing that came to my attention is they took it off of here. Well, I know Rob still has it on his page, so I'm going pull it up. That... Okay. This is their post about this kid. Alright? Now this kid has Down Syndrome. Just take a look at the kid, alright? Now... You're going to sit there and poke fun of a Down Syndrome kid. Or man. The, the post reads this from Fury. This is a negativity. This is what negativity, hate, and jealousy cause. I do not sell for or react to any of these lies. But for any site to do this is classless. Which I agree with. This past weekend, I called a long, a long time fan of SWF and pro wrestling into the ring and gave him the spotlight and moment, which maybe for a second he will never, he will, wouldn't forget, wouldn't forget he had Down syndrome. Now you're telling me that you're, it's okay to do this, especially to a fan of pro wrestling. So, I did my research and went to this fucking page. Mm -hmm. And I got no censored on this because this is fucking disgraceful. If my phone decides to freeze up again. This is their page on Facebook. Okay. Not only did they shit talk the fan but they have shit talked Daisy who used to work there Vinny Chenzo and even Rob Fury himself they said SWF Pereira Rob Fury puts untrained guys in the ring now what has a separated shoulder Now, I personally don't know Kate Christian or Sebastian Cage, but I am lucky enough to meet Kate Christian. There is no fucking way he's untrained. Okay? And judging by the performance on Saturday, where he did separate his shoulder, Sebastian Cage is not untrained. And I just want to read something that Uncle Cletus, or Cletus wrote, or whatever you want to call him. Since your credibility is shot now, considering you made fun of a Down Syndrome SWF fan, you want to explain who's untrained in that match, or on any show we run? King Christian, nor Cage, is untrained. Clearly, you assholes don't know anything about wrestling to even make a statement like that good luck with calling who SWF books untrained trying and moving the heat off you of your last post typical classless BWE they are fucking classless they obviously don't know shit about wrestling and the fact that really pisses me off it's all this talk about bullying, but yet you have a fan page who's sitting there bullying wrestlers who actually know how to wrestle and actually interact with their fans and done enormously 
enough shit in the business that you haven't done. As we just heard something where you get to clarify, so hold on. Anyway, as we had to clear it up, sorry. There's there's been too much I'm not gonna go into detail, but too much close calls, as we like to say. As the house phone rings. It's lovely. But anyway, the it's classless. It's classless. It's disgraceful. It made me want to fucking puke. Yes. As Lisa handles her kid over there. Thanks for being quiet on the set. I'm trying to. She's pissing me the fuck off. And the, the amount of disrespect SWF has for no reason, it's disgraceful. Okay? Not only SWF, but GTS, too, in general. Because I've been reading through their site, and they've been shit-talking GTS, too. And let me tell you, whoever the fuck it is, needs to put the bullshit away, put the stupid drama away, act like you're fucking age, and grow the fuck up. This is bullshit. How you going... How you gonna bash wrestlers for doing their fucking job? For doing their job, not only that, but putting up with the fucking, the heel hate, the, the name calling, the shit talking, the uh, fans getting in their face. And, and, and you guys have the common courtesy, they still shit talk them. And you know what? I'm gonna go into detail a little bit with this one. Me, my sister, and my mom recently had our dad pass. Okay, and who was there? Family and friends, yeah. Some. I'm gonna put quotation around that because I'm calling them out too. Some were there. Well, who was mostly there? Grim, Jay, who else? Lance. Ace, Rob, Rob Vinny, Waylon Cage, Leather. Sebastian Cage, Giant Leather. Should I keep going here? Even Bull James, and he doesn't even know me. Mom. Mom. Guys like Hollywood Mom. Hooligan, who got his fucking teeth knocked down his throat. By Kid Christian. By Kid Christian, yeah. Kid Christian's another one. Jordan Oliver's another one. <laughs> I mean, the list goes on. And you had the common courtesy to shit talk them? <laughs> and yeah, they still checking on us, as Lisa um, says. Um, but, the, I mean, it's just mind fucking that these people are still. Not only have a page on Facebook, but they're still around in the wrestling business. Yeah, UWC, the same way, but they haven't shit talked in, which I'm yeah. surprised. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. They haven't even shit talked CZW yet, too. Cause I, I swear to God, if they do, you're gonna hear a mouthful from me. Cause they have more balls than those fucking people behind a fucking keyboard does. You wanna add fucking I'm bullying to these guys? <laughs> and these guys. Wait, let's see how many fucking followers or likes they have on their page. Before I end this fucking rant. Oh, it doesn't even say. It, it doesn't even say, well. That, that, that's shocking to me because nine times out of ten, you just pissed off a whole SWF universe, a whole GTS universe, because I swear, as soon as Grim finds out, that shit's going to be all over fucking Twitter. You're going to have more hate than you already do. Especially for making fun of a Down Syndrome kid. Let's not, let's not forget about that. A Down Syndrome kid. How low can you stoop? Stoop. 
Is this just is this still? Oh, okay. Jack's gonna have to cut that one out. How fucking low? What's next? You're gonna make fun of our overseas people and fucking give me a place. <laughs> Afghanistan? Yeah. You're gonna make fun of the men and the women that served this fucking country next? Well, that's where it's going. That's gonna end my rant today. I wanna I wanna say that's a pretty low blow. Taking on somebody with Down syndrome. I'm disabled myself and I know what myself for a fact. That it doesn't make anybody feel good. And if it makes you feel good about picking on somebody that has an illness, a sickness, that makes you a pretty lousy person. In my book, you need your ass kicked. And I hope that you get it kicked by somebody that's got a disability. And then they sit there and make fun of you. See how you feel about it. See how you like it. You got to pick on somebody that's not all there, that's got problems. You got problems yourself, big ones. You two got any comments? No. Uh, you guys summed it up. It's just disrespectful. Lisa? There's a lot of kids in the picture that popped in the fucking mouth. Fucking piece of shit. They are. They're fucking scumbags. They ever want to show their fucking face? No. They're not. Fucking. Okay.